G'day, Glenn Morris here from the Smart Energy Lab. And today I just wanted to give you a sense of all the stuff I've got coming up uh, on the channel. I've got this new product from a company called Sig Energy. Sig Energy uh, make some amazing kit. And this is what I'm really excited about. They're 10 kilowatt three phase hybrid with stackable batteries up to 48 kilowatt hours plus a 25 kilowatt DC EV charger, all in one, and the app is something else. In fact, basically the unit is an entertainment system as well. When you look at all the, the, the ways you can modify uh, things like how it uses energy, how it uses uh, information from the cloud, and how you can uh, modify the look of the thing with some lovely RGB lighting. So, uh, SIG Energy, uh, that's coming up. Then we've got uh, Swatton. Swatton, uh, Another company that's probably a bit new to many people in Australia and New Zealand, uh, Swatton make a whole range of inverters. So I'm going to be unboxing uh, a Swatton inverter when I get back from, from China. I'm off to China to see my new friends, uh, <laughs> Tongwei from, from TW Solar. Then we've got uh, my good friends Solentech, who I've been to this factory. Uh, they're another one of these amazing uh, Chinese companies who can build incredibly high quality, sophisticated product very quickly and they do some big hybrids, up to like 50 kilowatt hybrid systems. But this is one of their 25 kilowatt grid ties. Then we've got ha, a microinverter. Now, microinverter is probably a bit of a misnomer. This is Hoy Miles. Um, this is a two kilowatt microinverter, not very micro, is it? <laughs> so for those uh, in Australia, you no longer are limited to 350 watts since 5033 uh, got updated and uh, we, we, we can go as big as we like as long as the input is extra low voltage, less than 120 volts DC. And lastly but not leastly, <laughs> is this, woo! This is a super capacitor from a South African company called West. Wow, I'm really excited by this. Not only am I going to unbox this monster, uh, but I'm going to put it to work. And thanks to the crew at Valen for sending it to me. Anyway, I've got my work cut out for me when I get back from China next week. Anyway, see you then.